Subodesan. Good morning. I'm in uh, Kandy, Sri Lanka. I see Buddha, Buddha statue over here in Kandy. I decided to hike up this small hill over here. And here there's a, an amazing Buddhist statue. This is Kandy. It's a Buddhist shrine. How beautiful is this? I've been walking on this hill for like 20 minutes now. Not in shape. Looks nice from down here. It's a beautiful climb though. Looks like it's still a work in progress. Looks like I have to remove my shoes or oh, slippers. Shoes I keep it. Alright, it's free, but I'm gonna give him something when I take it out. It's hot. It is hot on the ground. Oh, there's a ticket. Thank you. Is it only for foreigners? Alright, okay. How much is it? I don't have a change. Do you have a change? How much do you have? Thousand. This side. Okay. Thousand here. Thank you. Where I come from? India. India. Yeah. Are you? Thank you. Two hundred. Thank you very much. So that's normal here. In many attractions, it's only for foreigners the tickets. That's all right. It's all right for me, but I don't necessarily agree with it. But uh, I. Uh, I understand it's necessary for tourism. Look, it's tiny fish in the water. I wonder if I can go up to that platform. Hello, Subhadasana. You can go up? Ah, okay. Ah, apparently I can go up. Yeah, still construction work going on here. Ah, great. You can see the Candy Lake also from here. That's my next stop. This is uh, the Buddha statue's back side. Oh, things are broken here. Oh, look at the landscape here. The dome of the temple, green lush forest around the mountains. That's a hotel, I think. And people. That is a big ass stadium. I don't know if you can say, see it there here from here. Well, the thing is, right? In Europe, okay, you can go to the top. I can't really go to the front of Buddha's face. Maybe you can. All right, the thing is, right, I understand if it, this is for tourism, but the thing is, right, if we go to Europe or America, they don't distinguish like foreigners or locals it's just one price right so it feels a little bit weird when foreigners come here i understand it's not really discrimination but it's for tourism purposes it doesn't feel good either way that's the only criticism i do have but i guess that's fine right it would be better if without it wasn't there one price let's just think of it as tourism tax Suti. <laughs> Hello. What is that? Is it? Sri Lankan olive. Olive? Ah, okay. Uh, how much? Uh, 100 grams. 100. 100. Can I get a small? Small one. Like, like a little bit? Ah, let me taste this. It's okay. Mm. Okay. It's sour. <laughs> and this is mango. Mango. This? Amara. Amara mangoes. 
Uh huh. Okay, okay. I'll get some mango. Uh, mix? No, just mango. mango. I don't really like this. <laughs> mango, just. Yeah, this one. Is this candle? Thank you. Huh? No, 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 I'm walking down. Yeah, exercise. Mm. It's nice. Yeah, I'm sure that this is for no price. Yeah, let's see. It's chili and uh, salt in it. Sli slightly sweet as well. It's not really green mango. it's not easy to cross these roads here it's a very busy town I suppose somewhere near here is a railway station it's a bus stop Oh, at least one of the bus stations. This might be the train station. I don't know. Maybe. Nope. Some sort of municipality building. No, can be municipal central market. That's what it is. Chicken here. Because this is where you come to buy groceries. King Cobra. <laughs> oh, King Coconut. <laughs> So they call the coconuts here king coconuts of Tumbli. The most dangerous thing that it can happen to you in Kandy is that this bird shooting on you. Happened to me twice. Didn't quite land on me. Once landed on my feet. Yeah, the other one just right now. Almost. The splash has hit my feet. Subo <laughs> Dasana. Oh, there's that dead crow. Oh, oh, oh. Champion. One place where it gets easier to cross the roads is where you have these subways. The challenge is to figure out which exit. In a minute, I'll show you how crowded Candy is, or at least on this side of the street. But uh, I haven't actually tried to vlog in this much crowd before, so we'll see how that goes. Oh, 
once you are in the crowd it doesn't really feel like a crowd This is a major supermarket here called Food City and also behind that is a big mall called City Center Mall. That's a lake over there. Let's try to cross over. It's madness. Look at that! Hello. So it's called like Lake, Lake of Candy, Candy Lake, but it does also have another name. But its uh, popular name is Candy Lake. Look at all this bird shit. It's a famous temple over here called uh, it has Buddha's teeth. I don't know if you can see there's a snake. Is it a snake? Ah, there's a snake? Anyway, it is written that it is archaeological information center here. So I'm guessing this building is really, really old. Probably from the uh, era of Kingdom of Candy. Feel free to correct me on that one. This is Candy Lake. Oh. Whoa! That's a lot of fish. I guess they recognize humans and the food, right? Ah, okay, puri. You have to feed them puri. There's more here. Is it? Okay. All right. Use the face mask. That's the temple which uh, holds the teeth of Buddha. If you don't know, whew, that's hot. if you don't know, most of Sri Lanka's population is uh, Buddhist. Hello? No? Okay. No problem. This is proper candy city center over here. You can see the traffic, all sorts of vendors. By the way, for one night I stayed in that hotel over there, Hotel Casamara. Don't. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. Wearing mask is mandatory over here in public places where you cannot maintain a, I think it's one meter, but everyone pretty much wear a mask here. Uh, 
it's a 3000 rupees fine for six months jail time if you don't it's a lot of bakeries over here Sri Lankans do love their bakery anyway I'm going to go into this tiny sort of like bazaar slash market and see if I can find some local tea hello sorts of stuff here clothes mobile phone shops jewelry I don't think there's much going on in here mostly like uh, jewelry and stuff definitely some fake things Sugar. With sugar. Thank you. Straight across it without being get hit. I made it. Another dangerous, sort of dangerous thing to watch out for here is the uh, the footpath. Though people are walking on it, kind of like wiggles, and uh, it's easy to trip on them. So, so many people actually don't walk on them. They, look at this. By the way, that's the that's where I'm staying. Hello, doggo. Don't bite me, doggo. How are you? Good, uh, <laughs> how was the day? Yeah, I've been trying to like film a little oh, bit of candy. Okay, sure. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, too intense. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Very crowded. <laughs> yes, yeah, so because it's a small city actually, not a big. Not a big city. Yeah. Uh, so a lot of concentration yes, in yeah. one area. It's not like Colombo spread out. Yeah, and the weekend also. So it's it's effect for the crowded areas. Ah, okay. oh, yes, it's weekend. Yes, sir. and everyone is out and yes, about. Sir. Yeah, that's why. Sure. Right. Makes sense. Makes sense. But it was nice. I yeah. went to the lake. Okay. Went to the temple. Okay. I didn't go inside because okay. there was something happening inside. Yeah, because of the. Uh, it's like a religious place, so every day something. something ah, okay, yeah. so it's very crowded, so I decided not to go. Okay. Anyway, this is the hotel that I'm staying in. Savannah City. I'm just uh, showing them around. Like. Okay. Sure, <laughs> What's your name? I'm Kasum. Ka Kasum. Kasum. Yes, sir. All right. Nice okay. to meet you. Yeah. All right. So, this is the hotel, and oh, we have a lot of dolls up there. I'll just give you a quick tour about, about the quick tour of the hotel. We do actually have a sitting area over there. It's actually pretty nice. The only thing is that uh, the lift starts only from second floor. Two floors you had to walk up. Hello. How are you? Very good. <laughs> So here we have a big ass TV. Yes, sir. Does it work? Yes, sir. Okay. You're uh, repairing it, making repairs? Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. 
No, 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 it's okay. It's okay. I just, uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> hey. It's a stew. Let's just go quickly to the top floor. They do have a small pool over there and a restaurant and some good views of the town. And after that, I'm gonna end this video right over there because I'm tired. By the way, that tea was really good. That's the restaurant over there. It's a pool being used by people. It'd be pretty weird if I go there and film it. But I'll try. It's a bunch of solar panels. Nice candy. Any good? Hey, how are you? Hi. Fantastic, it's very hot. That's why there's a swimming pool. Absolutely, is it deep? No, it's like maybe a meter. Okay, okay. Because right. I'm not a very good swimmer. Where are you guys from? Poland. Poland? Yeah. And you? This is what? $36 a night get you in candy. Nice comfy bed. A spacious room too. Well lit, I would say. But it doesn't have a main light. Uh, but it's okay, I don't like light just above my head. Big nice uh, cupboard over here. The only thing it is lacking is the uh, safe. There's AC as well. And a nice big bathroom over here, spacious rain shower, and uh, two sinks, a nice toilet. So I thought I would just uh, give you a quick room tour. This is what $36 a night get you in candy. Be careful if you are looking, uh, booking something near to the city center. Even the shitty hotels charge more than this. So. This is just about like five or 10 minutes walk from the actual city center. It's in the, so, and it's also very noisy over there. So I prefer a little bit further. And uh, most of the hotels that are advertised as four stars are not four stars. They just say that online to trick people, really, so.